Hi, I'm Tom Nickel, and today I'm going to talk a little bit about cloud migration. Maybe you've already decided to take your business into the cloud, and you're evaluating the right combination of tools to make that happen. Or maybe your heart isn't set on migrating just yet, and you're analyzing the benefits. Either way, I'm happy you're here. I don't get to do stuff like this very often. Now, there's no single reason that businesses migrate, but a few that come up quite a bit. Tell me if any of these sound familiar. Increased capacity requirements, software or hardware refresh cycles, data center contract renewals coming up. The list goes on, and you should check out our blog post to see if any of these examples resonate personally. I've got time. OK. Of course, every company's story is a little different. And so deciding if you're ready to migrate is really the same as asking, how will I use the cloud once I'm there? Or better still, which combination of Google Cloud's storage, compute, networking, security, databases, and more can get me to the most agile, secure, functionally integrated cloud architecture? Phew, that was a mouthful, right? This can be a big, but simultaneously very fun question to answer. That's why, for starters, a detailed cost-benefit analysis is so important. If you're not sure where to start, Google's trusted partners can take stock of your unique operational landscape with a realistic return on investment for every choice baked right in. That way, you'll know exactly how you stand to reduce things like operational overhead and unused compute if you were to make the switch to the cloud, all before you ever commit to a migration plan. Next. It's important to remember that your journey to the cloud is your journey to the cloud. You'll decide if you want to move stuff as is first and keep it there, or maybe you modernize it after you move it, or maybe you want to modernize first, then migrate. Maybe you just want to rebuild a few things altogether. So where do you begin? For the workloads that you're looking to lift and shift, you'll turn to Migrate for Compute Engine, a tool that was purpose-built to move physical servers or VMs into Google Compute Engine. It's fast and scalable, and has cool stuff like testing, right-sizing, and stateful rollback built right in. Want more info? Here's a website you may want to check out. What about workloads you want to modernize as well? For that, you'd use Migrate for Anthos, which lets you upgrade workloads directly into containers in GKE. That means you can take physical servers or VMs that are on-prem in GCE or other clouds and containerize them in one fluid motion, a great way to migrate and modernize in parallel. What about data? If you've got a treasure trove of data and you don't want to migrate it over a network, you can load it up into our transfer appliance and ship it to us directly so we can quickly upload all that data for you. These are just three migration options Google offers. So when it's time to decide, Knowing which approach can save you the most time and money is a question our professional services team and partners can help you answer. Keep in mind that migrating also doesn't have to mean entirely abandoning your on-prem servers either. In fact, by definition, you'll be in a hybrid cloud state while any migration project progresses. But with Anthos, we make managing hybrid and multi-cloud easier than ever before giving you the flexibility to craft your ideal hybrid or multi-cloud, even while performing a migration in parallel. Learn about the most common patterns of cloud hybridization and multi-cloud here. Now, if after the analysis you determine that going fully serverless is the best path forward, you've got plenty of ways for you to rebuild things in the cloud as needed as well. You can read about the two main approaches and what makes them different here. OK, that was a lot to process. The honest answer, every digital transformation is unique, and you'll probably end up mixing and matching strategies. So what we want you to know is this. We have the technology you need, and we're here to help you craft the cloud and the migration journey that makes the most sense for you. OK, OK. Now that you've patiently listened to me talk at you for three minutes, I'm going to hand the controls back. The migration process can seem daunting, but the Google Cloud Adoption Framework is a great place to start, as is our Migration Center website. And with that, I say bon voyage on your migration journey, and thank you so much for taking the time to listen today.